Tonight, President Trump getting caught up in his own JFK conspiracy after deciding not to release all the documents tied to the assassination. So all of the records were supposed to have been released in 2017. What happened? President Trump uh, uh, tweeted that he was excited to release all of the remaining records of the assassination and what they might disclose. And then at the last minute, after meeting with the CIA, he decided to uh, postpone release. It's 1960s era material, and there are redactions that we put in because we felt in the 1990s there was still a reason to keep them from being released. But that's changed. Uh, this is 56 years after the assassination. There's no reason to protect this information anymore. It's a, certainly against the spirit uh, of the uh, JFK Records Act and technically now against the law because the mandate was to get everything out by 2017. You know, they had 25 years to plan for the due date in Washington. It's not just the Trump administration, but they're the ones who tweeted out saying it's all coming. Why the delay? Well, the White House is citing national security concerns, and we know that at least 18,000 records from the CIA are still being guarded. The president's decision coming after an appeal from the CIA and the FBI that releasing certain files could put the lives of some of our spies in danger.